Franklin and Marshall entered Saturday's contest against Muhlenberg looking to remain unbeaten at home. We're going to pick it up early in the first with Hike Giochin fights through a pair of defenders underneath for the basket. The senior forward led the team with 28 points and 8 boards. Later in the half, Matt Porter pulls up for a jumper to put FNM up by 2. The Diplomats' defense grabbed 12 steals on the afternoon. This one from Max Brewer as he takes it end-to-end -end for the basket. Still in the first, we see freshman Gordon Rogo goes to work hitting the unorthodox runner in the lane. And then less than a minute later, Rogo drives again, getting another layup to go. He finished with five on the day. Max Brewer finds Giochin for a three-pointer to increase the lead to 12. And then Morgan Lee gets in on the action with a long two, putting the Diplomats up by three. FNM entered halftime with a 30 to 22 lead. In the second, Porter finds Giochin for a three to make the score 35 to 22. And then with 16-10 remaining, Brandon Beckford's missed jumper is thrown down by John Salandra. He finished with six points and eight rebounds. Later in the half, Brewer finds Cedric Monet underneath the basket. And then the freshman forward shows off his defensive skills, picking up one of FNM's four blocks on the contest. With time winding down in the second half, Giochin goes to work behind the arc. He shot a ridiculous six of nine from three-point range in the game as the Diplomats roll over the Mules.